It's here, it's moving day. Our neighbor's gonna help us out with the move because we didn't have time to get the hitch put into the new truck. So it just makes more sense time-wise to shoot him a little and have him move us because they're actually gonna be moving to our site. So um, everything's packed up, we're ready to roll. get it on video. It's probably a good thing you did it. That's okay. We're, we're all right with no video proof of what we just did. <laughs> Alright, right. so... You don't want any cussing on there, right? Right. <laughs> okay, I'm day drinking. Don't judge. Um, <laughs> helps with my nerves. So, that whole thing is we're winging this and we're doing the best we can and we're not professionals. Um... I had to walk away as they were getting the cougar set because the truck got stuck. They ended up using the tractor bucket to lift up the front. Oh, yeah, but um, it's there, except it's not where the pad is because <laughs> the angle was just not um, working out. So, uh, this is where she's gonna sit. Um, you know, there was talk of possibly moving it again when um, it dries out a little bit because we've just had so much rain. Everything is so soupy at this stage. Just let it lie. Bring me in more gravel. So I've asked for more gravel like right here. And then I'm gonna be building a deck and grade this out a little bit for me so I have a little bit more of a flatter space so I can put my patio and we can put the awning out and. I have plans for an outdoor shower and you know just all those things so that's kind of where we stand I just can't believe with as much scraping as we did I mean we pulled so much off of this and it just is a huge money mess I get um I'm kind of depressed about it but if you can see how we're not where we're supposed to be but um we had to use the tractor so which was i just i had to walk away <sighs> and day drink a little bit so right now they're um cutting up some posts 
to uh, put underneath. And we're gonna build some cribbage to support that front end of the fifth wheel. We got water. Woohoo! Flushing the new filter. So we got the cribbage done. We are level and plumb or level on both sides. So um, I think those are pretty stout. I don't think we're gonna go anywhere. <sighs> I guess uh, building a deck is tops on my list. Huh? Yeah. So we were able to get the bump out out and super excited. Of course, we have a lot of work left to do. So the next week or two is going to be projects to make our lives comfortable while we're here, as well as working on the tiny house for Jake to get in. So this is where we're at right now. So someone had asked about the kitty box and um, I know we're not all fully set up yet, but, um, so this is just kind of a entertainment center. Of course, right now, since we had transport, they've got the pillows there to protect the TV. But, what? <laughs> this is awesome. So I ordered in this little Tom and Jerry door. And it sits right in front of our laundry chute. So during transport, we can either open it or close it. And they go in that way. And then their litter box and everything is right under here. So they have, whoo, they made a mess. So they have their own little private area. It keeps the litter box away from me, away out of sight, out of smell. And then, of course, we have an air purifier that I put right here on the floor. And, you know, that will take any residual smell that there may be because I can't tolerate smells. So, yeah. A little Tom and Jerry door is a thumbs up. It's awesome. Get one.
super glad to be here. <laughs>